Hey guys, it's Sherpa here. And uh, so I've got a couple things to do in this video. Um, I have six Theros Beyond Death packs that I'm going to open here. Um, but before we get to that, I wanna talk about some stuff that is going on that I've noticed at Target that I have personally bought and have noticed. So I have bought a couple, I bought three actually, Core 2020 booster box or booster packs that have come in these. I guess they're called like blister packs or whatnot. Um, so the pack is you. You basically pull this out and it's the pack in this. So what has been happening is these have been intact as intact as far as I can tell. Now what we think's been happening because these packs have been tampered with is that someone has been carefully sort of separating this section here and then re-gluing it. Um, and then what they're doing is they're they're taking the section, they're pulling the pack out, they're tampering with the pack, putting it back and re-gluing it. Now, I pulled it out of the, the, I pulled it out of this and it was already cut on the bottom like this. Like this, I did not have to open this. I have not opened it any further. I did nothing. Now I had another pack. Um, that was the, the whole back scene here was open and there was three additional dabs of glue. I've posted a video on Twitter about this earlier. Um, so I don't have the other pack with me at the moment. I did throw it away. The other thing that's interesting is I also bought two Theros at the time. So I bought two of these earlier and then I bought two Theros earlier. The Theros one have no numbers here. The core 2020 have, and I'm like, okay, you know, Maybe there was some sort of really weird machine error. Maybe there's something, maybe they're not tampered with. Well, today I realized that there is without a doubt that they are tampered with and I will show you why. So these ones, as you can kind of see, kind of see here, they have this sort of scarring mark on the back cards. This one is a little less noticeable. It doesn't seem like it's an actual, you can tell that there's a line, but it, there's no actual texture scarring, anything like that. So, but the way that I know without a doubt that these are in fact is because, here, let's just go reverse order real quick. It makes it a little bit easier to kind of show what I'm talking about. So now keep in mind, this is a core 2020 set, right? Core 2020 booster pack. That's, that's what we bought, core 2020. All right, now look, M20, M20, M20. And as you'll realize where this is probably going, the rare is not an M20, and that is how I realized. Because when I got to the rare, and I should have caught this on the last pack, I didn't. I was more just disturbed at the fact that it looked like it had potentially been tampered with to realize that it's an M19. This was a core 2020 booster pack with an M19 rare. Both of them are like that. All the other cards are M20. But the rare, not only are they like bulk cheap rares, but they're both from the wrong set. Now, the Theros packs I bought did not. The Theros packs I had I actually had a, a solid rare and, you know, were actually from the right sets. And the Theros showed no signs of tampering. So these five that I just purchased are actually from a different Target. And this one, I didn't purchase it earlier, but we had to go back to Target. And so I purchased it, but this one was like this off the shelf. So I'm curious to see if this Theros is actually going to be tampered with, where previously it had only been the Core 2020s I bought. So I bought in three Core 2020s, I purchased three Core 2020s, sorry, Botton's not correct. Um, I purchased three Core 2020s, and they have all been tampered with. And they've all had M19s because uh, the other pack that I purchased actually had this Windrider Sphinx as well. And I totally just didn't even realize that it was an M19 and not an M20. So I'm really curious. We're going to start with this one since this one already looks like it's been. So I'm wondering what we kind of think is happening is someone is buying these, carefully reopening them, swapping the card out, and then returning them. So this one looks good so far. I don't see any, normally what it would be is cut along up here and there'd be very visible signs of tampering. 
Uh, that looks a little weird at the bottom, but not that weird really. So that was the thing where I was wondering how the hell were they getting these open? And Amy actually tested it with my knife and carefully slowly cut it open. It wasn't perfect, but if someone's perfected a way to open these and everything, um, I made a PSA about it. I tagged Target and Wizards. Uh, I even tagged Rudy um, of Alpha Investments just to like kind of get the word out because this is probably just a localized event, but maybe it's not, you know? And so this one looks fine. Um, so we are just kind of doing a normal opening, but I did want to talk about that as well because that's something that just, it's crazy, you know? Like I've seen the videos, but I never ever expected to be involved in something like that. Oh, another Timeric, cool. So let's see, and ah, Phoenix of the Ash, okay. Oh, hey, and a Transcendent Envoy Foil, nice. Okay, dope, dope, dope. Yeah, so I I don't know, that's, um, and I'm, worri I'm worried that these other ones could be potentially tampered with, but this is a different target. So I'm hoping it was just the single, because the other ones I had, the other one I purchased, excuse me, had also been from that target. So, ooh. yeah, so see these ones so far are seeming normal. There doesn't seem to be any, and it'd be very, it'd be pretty apparent, honestly, if it's, if it's been tampered with on the Theros ones, I feel like, because they're packed quality feels a little bit different like not really but i think it's just because of the printing colors that um you know they have on that and our rare is oh <laughs> it was in a that's funny that's actually the promo card that i ended up getting um so obviously i'm hoping, hoping for like a titan or something you know it's these are loose packs though so i don't know how lucky we'll really get but oh man these ones, yeah, okay, I'm starting to really wonder because these ones definitely seem harder to open than the other ones have been, so, uh, at least the core 2020 ones, so, that's why I'm like, I'm starting to get even more suspicious now, but yeah, if, if the rare change doesn't give it away, I really don't know, and I'm like, I don't really know what I can do with this information moving forward, um, like, you know, I'm not, I'm not too butthurt, it's only, it's only been three packs, um, there's still, you know, I don't really care so much I lost the value, but at the same time, I don't want someone else. Um, oh, hey, nice. Green Merchant of Asphodel. I don't want someone else coming along and trying to purchase these cards, like especially like a mother for their kid or something, and them getting, you know, screwed over by this because that's not fair. Like, I, I'll, I'll eat the loss. I don't care. That's fine. I just want to make people aware so that people know to look out for it. And even if it's in this blister and it doesn't mean it's going to be, you know, a hundred percent untampered with. And that's the weird thing too, is like I said, with the pack, it was blatantly obvious with both of the packs, actually all three of the packs, but like it's, it's blatantly like it is open in the pack. So you can tell, and it's one of those things that you definitely need to keep your eyes peeled for. And like, I, Honestly, if there was more core, core 2020, I would have bought them and I would have, I would have like opened them on on camera just to showcase. Honestly, like I was gonna, if there was one more, I would have taken it. Just went like bought it, told the checkout person to watch me walk over to the returns and opened it in front of them to show them because like I think that would have been a really good way for them to see. Oh, Delicus. Oh shit! In a foil Renata. Nice. Okay. I don't have too many foot, and I got an annex. Nice. Elspeth's Nightmare. I don't have that one, I don't believe, so. All right, so we got a couple legendary creatures. That's kind of dope. Uh, Nailers and Ranchin. Okay. I'll have to sort these later. I just got done resorting my set, um, my collection not that long ago. But, uh, yeah, so. Sorry for this different sort of video. Um, but uh, I will be posting this pretty quickly here, so if you guys... Um, are interested in checking me uh, out on Twitch. I will be uh, live a little bit later tonight, actually. Um, but if you have any questions on this matter, feel free to ask me. Um, I know that some people might think that this is done as like a stunt or something, but I really have nothing to gain from this, and I hope, really hope people don't 
consider that as an option because I really have no interest in doing. Hey, Nadir's cracking. Nice. No interest in doing anything of that nature. Like, I, this is not, I'm not trying to just like make up a story for clout or anything because I have no, I have no, I have no desire. I have no need for that. So, but, uh, yeah, because I, all I care about is informing the people, letting people know, hey, this is a problem. I want to draw attention to it just so we can fix it. I don't really care about anything beyond that. You know, I just want people to be aware. I want people to be able to fix things um, where, where things can be fixed if it's, you know, because I thought initially maybe it was just an issue from manufacturing or something. Maybe there was something additional there. But I, you know, I'm starting to think less and less of that. I'm starting to think someone bought carefully surgically replaced and except they they were careful with the the blister but they weren't careful with the actual pack you know so i don't know ah, another renata um oh, what is our rear it looks like oh another harpy and a ah okay so we got two of these harpies okay i think those are worth a little bit nothing too insane that looks like, that's a pretty nice foil though so all right, well, there we go. That's all the, I like how you can tell where the little tokens are every so often because of the, <laughs> like the extra, extra um, white ones because we don't have the, yeah, okay, anyway. Um, yeah, but there you go, guys. If you are looking at Core 2020 packs at Target, and this is only at Target I've noticed because that's where I've been buying them right now just with uh, everything going on because of the quarantine and whatnot. And that's where I'm usually am when I'm buying groceries and stuff and things right now currently. So, but yeah, I'm really curious. I should look up this code. I don't know where the process to do that is, but if someone wants to look up where that came from, there you go. Um, thanks for viewing, guys, and hopefully I'll see you later on uh, twitch.tv slash Sherpa.